People are always saying you've got to learn to love yourself before you can learn to love anybody else. And it's great advice. There's only one problem. They don't explain how you can love yourself. Um, and I think they miss out one incredibly important piece of advice. You've got to love yourself enough because actually sometimes we try and love ourselves so much and have such high self-esteem that that actually can become trampling all over everybody else. And it can sometimes be so high, it just completely collapses and we feel a complete utter failure if we're not prime minister by the time we're 25. Um, conversely, you don't want to go to the opposite extreme and have such low self-esteem that you're prepared to let everybody walk over you like a, a doormat, which is why I talk about loving yourself enough enough to actually value yourself but also enough to actually realize that it takes two people to make a relationship and working on both halves of the relationship. One of the important things in Learn to Love Yourself Enough is actually looking at where all these negative voices come from, trying and unhook them from the past and actually having a different kind of relationship with that nagging voice inside your head. Instead of trying to ignore it or talk it down, my advice is to actually listen to it. And if you listen to it, and by this I mean actually take dictation, write every nasty thing that little voice inside your head is saying down on a piece of paper, and you can then go back and question it, because what you'll find is it exaggerates. Um, it actually makes unsubstantiated statements. Um, and also, you tend to put together entirely unconnected little pieces of information from different parts of your life to make one overall sweeping statement about yourself. So if you begin to challenge the voice rather than ignoring it or trying to chant it down with positive affirmations, you'll be able to change your relationship with yourself and that in turn will improve your self-esteem and improve all of your relationships.